Right, got the Keystone Outback 2017 model. It's the 326 RL for rear living. Got uh, double fridges coming in through the door there. Your kitchen area, a little coffee section, storage above. You got the vent and light under there above the stove. Large counter space right here keep your daily use items peninsula a uh, whole lot of storage under here storage under the stove these for utensils storage under the sink one large sink rather than the split in the middle it's really nice got a booth Two large pull-out drawers under the booth. Turns into a bed. You got storage over the top of the couch here, which also turns into a queen bed. Fireplace, functional. The TV there swings away from the wall and pivots. And when you're in travel mode, it's got a little locking mechanism back there that you lock it to the wall. Uh, both of these are recliners. that are really nice and comfortable. They lay almost flat. Pretty sweet. Storage over the top of them, of course. Uh, another little access area right here. The whole peninsula has got storage in it there. Uh, over here, we got the pantry. I've added this little spice rack myself. Uh, makes things handy. You don't have to get them out. They're always right here in view. Added a little bit of shelving in here just to have a little more space. But yeah, plenty of room in the pantry. Little spot for shoes. We're going to the bathroom here. That's the master bedroom over there. Here is the bathroom. One thing in the bathroom I have done is upgraded the fan. Uh, this is a one of the more high flow fans. And uh, it's a very nice upgrade. The shower, I have upgraded the faucet in the shower to a more efficient one. Produces better pressure. Uh, quite a bit of quite a bit of room in here for stuff. Here is the master bedroom. It's very nice. Got a slide in here. The whole bed slides out. Make a king bed, and you got plenty of walking room in front of it as you see here you got a dresser four large drawers for the dresser they hold quite a bit of stuff i don't even have these i don't even have them all full that one doesn't have anything in it uh tv in here also cabinets on both sides you got uh sliding closet mirrors large closet in the nose of this trailer which is really nice very nice uh storage over the bed there's some uh deeper cabinets so that's where i keep my towels extra pillows go in there uh this side over here pants another little drawer here some winter items in there I got some hooks for hoodies in the corner. Got a plug over here where I plug in my extra heater. I got a plug over here for charging my phone at night. I made this extra little table here. And there's another little spot on the other side of the bed for a little bit of uh, storage, water bottle, uh, TV remote, whatever. But yeah, that's about it there. Two air conditioners. We'll look at this control panel real quick. 
Uh, there is the thermostat for the main air conditioner and the other one you control from the uh, bedroom. Yeah, this is just the, uh, the uh, electronic system for the trailer. This is where you control your lights and your uh, jacks and awning and all that good stuff. Water pump, interior, exterior lights, water heater, everything functional. Uh, I've had the trailer for a few years now and I've really enjoyed it. Just trying to upgrade it in size uh, for my growing family. But I really hate to see it go because it is a nice trailer and I've enjoyed it. Anyway, all right.